you don't think Lindholm exactly played this wrong, we'll say. And I think he did on what ended up being the game winner. I think he played it wrong by trying to tell Raquel to cross in front of him to go after, I believe it was Hart who got that uh, that last goal there, if I'm not mistaken. Hartman, yeah. Or was. Hartman, yeah. yeah. Um, he's telling him to cross in front of him to go do it when he's closer to the guy that Lindholm is trying to cover on a cross crease at least. Mm-hmm. But by pulling away from there, okay, Gibson should maybe have this shot as well but yeah it is on the move at the same time so it's kind of a mix of both but Lindholm is moving away from that you see Raquel kind of like look back and forth and be like what the fuck and try to get over to Hartman and whatnot like I I think Lindholm trying to direct that play there is what up is what ultimately cost us unfortunately besides the turnover at center ice you know but just that play if Lynn like I yes and you were saying how he was on the ice for a lot longer than he normally is. We'll put it that way at yeah. that point. When, so yeah, he's look, a little bit yeah. tired and that sort of thing. But like when he wasn't in the penalty box for overtime, he was on the ice. So he, yeah. he actually had three minutes of ice time and, in overtime. But even then, even if you're tired as an NHL caliber defenseman, you got to know that if the other guys covered already, not to direct somebody to who you are closest to. See, I don't think that other guy was covered, in, in my opinion. The the pass Raquel, option. Raquel's at least but Raquel is at least between Gibson and the other guy. I can't I can't remember who it was. He's at he's in a better spot than Lindholm is to defend that guy in particular. Lindholm was in a better position to defend against Hartman. See, Even if I it don't... is just steering him a little bit more to the outside or putting the pressure on him, there, there's the difference we were talking before. I felt there was the difference between if Hartman takes that shot because he's pressured, he's like, oh shit, I got to take the shot now. It's kind of rushed. And what I felt actually happened was Hartman was given the time to set up his shot and place it exactly where he wanted to go. Yeah, I mean, he definitely shouldn't have had that much time, but I... I don't think Raquel is, uh, or sorry, I don't think Lindholm is the guy to put that pressure on. And I think um, Raquel should have tried to get over there, as he did. Um, I think that was the right call because of, of the way that Raquel was already skating and the way that the guy, uh, the other guy, the second guy, Minnesota guy in was skating. Raquel would have had to turn around, or like stop and turn around to go and cover that guy, which would then leave him wide open. So... I think him keeping that momentum going forward, Lindholm adjusting his path backwards to, you know, cover the, if that guy got the pass from well, Hartman it's not, it's, to cover that that shot. I, I think that's the right play. And you leave Gibson with the shot there. Yes, it's a little bit more risky. You would rather have a body in front of that, but with how broken that play is and with how tired everybody was late in overtime, except Hartman because he just came off the bench, I, I think that's the right play. I don't place blame on Lindholm. I don't place game on blame on Raquel I really don't place blame on on Gibson even though if I had to I would place it on him for having that shot but I, I think that was the right yeah. call by Lindholm also <laughs> I think Lindholm had a shit rest of the game obviously the penalties he took were abysmal um, Lindholm just had a bad few games I think I yeah I agree with you he I think he needs a reset whether like just I don't know I I, I just think he needs <laughs> a game just needs a game off. Same as yeah. Comtois, same as we saw with Henrique. He just needs a break to observe from the press box and be like, okay, I'm good. Yeah. Because I think yeah. he's one of our most uh, important defensemen. So Yeah, and there you go. We're back to agreement. <laughs> yeah. 